Welcome everybody, my name is Michael and today we are discussing about the Deputy Governor of the Bank of England has decided to come out and say that what is happening right now in cryptocurrency with the crash and many companies falling down well, if we take a step into the future, we will realize that the survivors will become the Amazons and Ebays of what is similar to what occurred back in the 1990s, late 1990s, early double uh, O's. I don't know how to say that generation. So the dot-com boom, you had $5 trillion that was wiped off of valuations. And you had anything from the Beanie Babies to Pets.com to pretty much anything uh, and then you just put a .com after it, like X.com, except some companies like X.com later turned into PayPal, and you had the PayPal Mafia, and you had so many tech millionaires and billionaires that were formed, but also some major losers, and people were parting like crazy, and in many cases, there's some similarities to crypto. There's some startups that got too much investor capital when there was this massive hype and then suddenly everything crashed and the hype died down and only a couple players remained and at one point Amazon was so lowly valued that people were making fun of Jeff Bezos and they said, you know, your your company's not going to survive this and now today he's the one of the world's richest people ever. He was the world's richest up until Elon Musk beat him, but still $200 billion after a divorce is nothing to complain complain about. And I'm sure the guy's going to be a trillionaire one of these days. So there were plenty of millionaires that came out of that. And same thing with this time around. You have Bitcoin that fell so greatly from 70,000 to 20,000 and below. But now is the most important time. Whoever is able to survive this, and this is just companies, this is investors as well. We will the hodlers right now, we will be able to go forward into the future with the experience that we have from this crash and what is going on right now. If we start accumulating cryptocurrency right now and everything starts to go back up, at least the valuable projects, then we're going to be rich. We're at least close to it. They're definitely financially independent, financially well off for most people. So number one thing is to start Bitcoin dollar cost averaging right now. It's an exciting time to do it. And it doesn't matter if Bitcoins continue to drop because that's the whole point of dollar cost averaging. If you're not doing dollar cost averaging every week or every month or every X period of time, whatever you determine is a good number to every every couple of weeks, every couple of months, whatever your number is, then you deposit X sum, whatever that is as well. Could be 5% of your paycheck, could be 10% of your paycheck. If you don't start doing that right now, then you are just trying to time the mark. So Mr. Cunliffe is comparing that $5 trillion drop to the over $2 trillion, $2.2 trillion drop in crypto right now. And fintech is not going away. Uh, tech companies also huge losses in the stock market, huge losses all around the world. All global assets have gone down, but tech companies out of all of them were the most overvalued and overhyped and they grew too quickly. And some of them were scams. Some of them were ill-prepared. Uh, they had great technology, great ideas, great hopes, but venture capital funds rolled in and people went crazy. They went mad with all these new funds and they ended up going insolvent because they mismanaged their money. They unfortunately were not able to hire the right people and eventually their companies were beat by others or due to some failures, maybe from the founder, maybe from the employees, the company was just not able to attain their goals and they lost funding. So there's gonna be a lot of that in crypto. There's gonna be a lot of that over the next couple of months. There's gonna be a lot of scams. A lot of stuff is already coming out of the woodwork, but this is an exciting time because also as an investor, you're looking for these gems. You're looking for that diamond in the rough that when it is ready, you are going to be able to buy that and hopefully ride that to the moon. <laughs> this sounds absolutely silly, but yeah, if, if you have some money right now, if you're an angel investor, a VC capitalist, well, you're going to be able to make a ton of money from finding the survivors and being the savior, I guess, so to speak. Right now is an amazing time to invest if you have money, if you have a good stable job, if you have an emergency fund. Um, if you're not prepared, well, don't do anything just yet. Don't don't get too hyped up about this because there's so many more opportunities. We're still in the infancy phases of cryptocurrency and every single crash, there's a ton of opportunity. So get excited, get pumped. And that is that for today's video. So thanks so much for watching. Have a great rest of your day. Take care. It was a long day. I'm going to sleep. Bye.